This is a GCE L-Level Pure Physics Revision Series. In this video, we are going to discuss, important physics definitions that you must know before you take your exam. There are two chapters to discuss. Chapter 18. DC Circuits. And. Chapter 19. Practical Electricity. This video is brought to you by, Ace with Dennis. Now, learning can be smart not hard. Don't forget to subscribe and press the bell notification button to stop missing out important updates from us. Also, check out the description area to sign up to our signature course, GCE L-Level Pure Physics Full Course, at unbelievable price. It's one-time payment. You can study anytime you like, anywhere at your convenience. You can also easily monitor and track your study with Udemy's system. There is no recurring monthly tuition fees. No expensive intensive revision workshops. You don't have to rush to any tuition centers. You don't have to worry on missing any lessons. Sign up our signature online course at description area now. Without further ado, let's get started now. Chapter 18. DC Circuits. This diagram shows a series circuit where three resistance, R1, R2, and R3, are connected in series. The total current, IT, equals I1, equals I2, equals I3. The total EMF, Epsilon T, equals Epsilon 1, plus Epsilon 2, plus Epsilon 3. The total potential difference, VT, equals V1, plus V2, plus V3. The total resistance, RT, equals R1, plus R2, plus R3. This diagram shows a parallel circuit where three resistance, R1, R2, and R3, are connected in parallel. The total current, IT, equals I1, plus I2, plus I3. The EMF, Epsilon, equals the potential difference, V1, equals the potential difference, V2, equals the potential difference V3. The total resistance, 1 over RT, equals 1 over R1, plus 1 over R2, plus 1 over R3. This diagram shows a potential divider circuit. The current, I, equals V1 over R1, equals V2 over R2. The EMF, Epsilon, equals the potential difference Vn, equals the potential difference V1, plus the potential difference V2. The potential difference V1, equals R1, over R1, plus R2, times Vn. The potential difference V2, equals R2, over R1, plus R2, times Vn. Thermistors and light-dependent resistors. LDR. This is the symbol of a thermistor. The resistance of a common thermistor decreases as the temperature increases. This is the symbol of a LDR. The resistance of a LDR decreases as the light intensity increases. Chapter 19. Practical Electricity. Use of Electricity. Electrical appliances convert electrical energy to other useful energies. Heating elements and electrical appliances, kettles, irons, water heaters, convert electrical energy to thermal energy. Heating elements are usually made of nichrome as it has high resistance and high melting point. Electrical energy, E, can be calculated with the formula. E equals, VIT equals, I square RT equals, V square over RT. Electrical energy consumption is measured in kilowatt hour, KWH. 1 kilowatt hour is the amount of electrical energy used by an electrical appliance rated at 1 kilowatt for 1 hour. Electrical power, P, can be calculated with the formula. P equals, VI equals, I square R, equals, V square over R. Electrical power is the rate of conversion of electrical energy. The SI unit of electrical power is Watt, W. Danger of electricity. Short circuit happens when current flows through a path with much lower resistance than the one intended. A short circuit causes excessive current to pass through the circuit and produces large amount of heat within a short period of time. Electricity can be dangerous due to 
damaged insulation which can cause electric shocks, overheating of cables which can cause fires, damp conditions which can cause electric shocks. In a 3-pin plug, life wire carries current into an appliance and neutral wire carries current out of the appliance. Earth wire is connected to the ground. The earth wire provides a low resistance path for electric current to flow from the metal parts of a faulty appliance to the ground. This can prevent electric shock when someone touches the faulty appliance. This is the symbol of a fuse. The fuse is a safety device that is connected to the life wire. It melts and disconnect a circuit when excessive current flows through it. The current rating of a fuse is the minimum amount of current that will cause it to melt. A circuit breaker is a safety device that automatically switches off a circuit when excessive current flows through it. This protects electrical appliances from damage due to circuit fault. There are three types of circuit breakers. A. The Miniature Circuit Breaker, MCB. It is tripped by excessive current flow. B. The Earth Leakage Circuit Breaker, ELCB. It detects current in the earth wires. C. The Residual Current Detector, RCD. It compares the current in life and neutral wires. Double insulation is a safety feature that uses two layers of insulation that keeps electricity within the circuit and protects the appliance's internal components. Double insulated appliances use two pin plugs as they do not need for earth wire and they usually do not have a metal casing. Switches, fuses and circuit breakers are usually connected to the life wire. This is because when a circuit is disconnected by these safety devices, current is no longer supplied to the faulty circuit or electrical appliance. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Do you have any thoughts, opinion or experience want to share? Write it down in the comment area. We'd love to hear from you. Also, do you like this video? Don't forget to like and share it to your friends. Until then, see you in the next video. Have a great day ahead.